We're going to start this morning with Stacy De Silva in Polk County, where a lockdown was just lifted at Davenport School of the Arts. Stacy. Yeah, no Evan and Stacy, what a scary morning here in Davenport for parents. Let's take a look at the scene. It's still active here. You can see it's a bit chaotic with parents parking along the road. Um, law enforcement still on scene here at the Davenport School of the Arts. How this all happened, a parent called 911 when she saw two men holding weapons near the school. That happened at around 820, putting the school of 1,100 kids K through 8 on lockdown for an hour and 40 minutes. The Poole County Sheriff's Office began going door to door in a nearby neighborhood looking for the men. We're told deputies found two young men who matched the description. They had BB guns but claimed they did not display them. At around 10 a.m., the lockdown was lifted. And now I'm going to be joined live by one of the parents here, Joy Sutkiss. Your daughter Miley goes to the school. Yep. What was today like and, and how did you find out about this? Uh, well, she FaceTimed me just before 8.30 and I was like, that's kind of weird. She should be getting into class. And she looked really scared. She was on the bus and she said, Mom, um, something's going on. We were in the bus and cops were flying in and I seen them with guns. And the bus driver said we need to get out of here as far away as possible. And they're taking us somewhere else. And so uh, immediately I was freaked out and um, sorry, phone is ringing. Um, and so I just kept her on the phone with me. And then I guess they took her to another school and um, very appreciative that there were so many law enforcement that were um, here for our kids, mm -hmm. that's for sure. You but. see this on TV, right? You never think it's going to happen here. Yeah, no, no. This is a, an amazing school, amazing area, and thank God it wasn't as bad as it sounded at first. Miley, what was that like for you? Um, it was pretty scary because I just saw, like, cops flying in, and the bus driver said that we had to get away, like, as far as possible. And um, she took us to Lofman Oaks. Oh. Miley, I'm glad you're okay. All right, so students were released from the day. Miley will be able to go home with her mom. Classes will begin again tomorrow. Polk County Sheriff's Office will be here for the couple days just as an added precaution. Live in Polk County, Stacey DeSilva, 8 on your side.